Welcome to getting started user portal login. The user portal login is typically used by offices to try to restrict access to their clients uh, for specific employees. So it has to be set up on their user page, on that specific employee's user page in the security information section where you would label that the only way they can log in is through the user portal login. So as you look here, we have the login. Right below here, it says user portal. That's what I'm referring to when I talk about the user portal login. So I could, if I try to log in for this specific user, Andy, I said he's only able to use the user portal login. And what that's gonna allow him to see is his assigned tasks, his appointments, his work schedule. Um, he can access some of the tabs, but he will not have access to any clients. So when he tries to log in using the normal login, it's going to say you have entered an invalid login or your user is not allowed to access the specified system. You may want to try logging in using the user portal link. So if he goes ahead and clicks on the user portal link, types in his username and password, he's now able to get in. And what he sees is the user overview, the office overview. So his assigned tasks, his messages, appointments, his work schedule. So if you wanna give access to your employees can use this after hours. We've some told them don't use a normal login, use the user portal login. That way all you can do is see your work schedule and your appointments. And you don't need to see the clients outside the office. And there are certain reports you can run to make sure that they are abiding by your rules and not using the normal login outside the office. You can see if they are or they are not. Or if you wanna cut them off completely, you can restrict them. And that's again, that's set up on their user page in the security information. The problem with that is if you switch them over just to the, the user portal login as they leave the office, you have to switch them back over to the normal login as they come back in for work because you obviously want them to see your clients. So normally it's we just tell them use a user portal login after hours and don't use a normal login when you're at home. So from here they could, if they click on the home page, this is what they'll see. If they click on the search page, trying to locate a client, they're restricted. Punch clock, they actually can punch in if you want them to. Appointments, they're restricted if seen. There's calendar. Availability, they could see their own availability. Work schedule, they're restricted. Additional links, they can access. And the reports, they can access. But they will not be able to get into a client file. That's all I have for the user portal login. Thank you.